there are two types of magnetism, ferromagnetism and paramagnetism. Ferromagnetism affects iron, nickel, and cobalt at room temperature. And with our strong magnet, you can see this is a very strong force. This ferromagnetism is also used in coinage metals like nickel. Here we have a Canadian nickel, and it's attracted by a magnet because it has nickel in it. Even though we call this a nickel, an American made a nickel doesn't contain nickel anymore. And a Canadian quarter contains nickel. Paramagnetism results from unshared electrons in an orbital. Here we have manganese sulfate hanging in a little bottle. And as I move the strong magnet, you can see that it's attracted. It's a very weak magnetic field by comparison to the ferromagnetic, but you can see that it's definitely attracted.